Welcome to the SEO.co Search Engine Optimization Podcast. Digital marketing essentials and next level tactics. From off-site and on-site optimization to persuasive selling and everything in between. You'll learn actionable tips on what it takes to outright and outrank your competition. Now, here's your host, Nate Nee. Here we are again for another episode of the SEO.co podcast. Um, I, I want to give credence to and just discuss uh, outreach link building and avoiding outreach link building spam. And I am a, uh, it's funny because we do, uh, we send thousands of, I don't even know how many, it'd be almost impossible to count. I guess we could count it at some point, but we send out thousands of emails every month, probably every week related to uh, trying to source uh, link opportunities and link building opportunities for our clients. And in doing so, <clears throat> we we try our best, try our darndest to do so in such a way that's um, not spammy. That's the best way I could put it. We, we do so in, in a way that where we're attempting to, um, you know, just be be good neighbors, be neighborly and do the outreach in a holistic way. And that's tough. It's tough to do. The The world is tired of spam. I absolutely abhor, uh, detest and hate spam. And if, if I get an outreach email, I usually block them because uh, oftentimes they might be in a sequence where I'll then get another, receive another email within a week if I've not responded and I just, I can't handle it. It's a distraction. Um, it fills up my inbox with junk and I just can't, I just don't, I just don't stand for it. So the, the proliferation of, of outreach, particularly in the marketing realm, you know, we are in marketing just like so many others are. And there's obviously a want and a need for everybody that's a marketer to utilize the websites of others, uh, the domain authority, the authority that some of these uh, some other websites have built up over time and to leverage that uh, to their own end. And I love what uh, Sam on our team uh, often says. He he says, you know, why don't you, uh, you know, take me out for a drink before you, you know, want to wine and dine me before you want to do anything else with me? Because it's uh, so often people are more apt to ask for something rather than give. And while I'm not a huge fan of uh, Gary Vaynerchuk. Uh, you know, he does, he did write a book, uh, the, the jab, jab, right hook. I think it's, we, we, especially in the outreach world where when we do it in a volume play, we are so often asking for something, uh, out of, out of left field, out of the blue. You don't know this, this person doesn't know you from Adam. You're asking for a link, uh, where most people aren't willing to give them. And you're doing so in a way that nobody wants to, to provide uh, a link because you've not given them anything of value. So what you're asking for is, is hey, we want to take value, but we're not really willing to give value. And if, if you're not willing to give value, then the likelihood that you're going to receive value is extremely low. And the best outreach campaigns I've seen are Hey, I just, you know, someone links to an article that you did and asks for, uh, you know, an honorable mention somewhere linking to that article uh, from you or not like a, not necessarily a reciprocal link, but something that shows that you really do uh, and uh, do care about, uh, you know, building rapport, building relationships. And that means give, giving first before asking and making sure that the sequences that you build for your outreach link building are just not annoying and not too frequent and you're you're keeping it uh, really genteel and, and not pounding people with what I would consider spam at the end of the day. So that's this is a little bit of a tirade, but it, uh, it really is uh, 
you know, something that we see a lot of and something that we do a lot of. So it's, it, you run a fine line uh, between that. And obviously you want to make sure you're compliant with GDPR and everything like that. So those are my two cents on, on link building uh, outreach. Uh, hope you enjoy this episode. Thanks for joining us and hope, hope to have you uh, back on again soon. Thank you for joining us on the SEO.co podcast. We appreciate your time. Be sure to rate, review, and subscribe to the show and visit SEO.co for more resources based on today's topic, as well as access to more podcast episodes to help you improve your site's long-term SEO success.